Welcome back, boys and girls. More old school RuneScape. Now, this is the first new recording of a new session. And uh, while we were uh, away, um, our friend Connor said, Hey, can I grind off camera for you guys to get some levels up? And, and, I, and you know, being the nice guy I am, I, I said, Sure, Connor. Uh, so Connor went a little overboard, and uh, we're now level 27. Um, we have full mithril armor. Yes, full mithril armor. Um, Look at this. We got a Team Tin cape. I don't know what that is, but it's got Team Tin in the name. So so it's perfect for us. Gotta be good. Got Jesus Christ, Connor. Look at these skills. Look, 23? 20? Fucking 34 cooking? Connor, what, you, what did you do? <laughs> he really, uh... He went, he, he went all out. 14 prayer? Maybe, maybe he th maybe he accidentally God. like thought this was his account. I was like he started playing. I was like I was like Connor. All right, now now we don't want to do too much off camera, so just get a couple of levels up, <laughs> like like in between episodes. You just know, so we just can like, at least start doing like beginning quests and stuff like that. Yeah, and I told him I was like you know just just like you know maybe get us up a couple levels. Fuck it, level 27 now. We were level five when we left off. <laughs> level 27 for 20 levels. I was like he told me and I was like Jesus Christ, Connor. I was like what? I was like, we, we need to do some stuff on camera. So now uh, we're level no, 27. No, 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 our, no, our episodes are just showing off what Connor has done now. Yeah, so <laughs> anyway, now that we're very high level, uh, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do some quests. Cause guess what? Uh, I got a members account. So Mama's Boy is now officially a member. We can go anywhere in the RuneScape world. Yes. Have all these new skills unlocked, we can do all these quests. So we're gonna do fishing contests, cause you know, I'm, on, I'm in the mood for some fishing today, Ryan. They, they thought we were coming back with a level 5 Nimrod, and we're back with a level 27 Mama's Boy. Look at that, level 27. So, uh, so yeah, I can start this quest by speaking to the dwarves at the tunnel entrances on either side of White Wolf Mountain. I must have level 10 fishing. And thanks to Connor, we have level... Th 9 fit. Connor, why'd you level up cooking to 34 but didn't even get us to 10 with fishing? Ugh. Really? D we gotta go boost up our fishing level a level. What, was it worth getting wood cutting to 19, Connor? But but not fishing to, to at least 10? Dude, you better watch out. He's gonna come out with an explanation. He's gonna, like, have a manifesto written out and everything. God damn, dude. Alright, well, I gotta go... I gotta go... I gotta go fishing um, to get our level up a little more. Oh, and look at that, Connor. He put our f you, you put our fishing net in the bank, so I gotta go get that out of the bank. Thanks a lot, oh, buddy. Oh, jeez. Let me get out my fishing net so I can level up our fishing to level 10, and then we can start this fishing quest. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. And guys, we, we would love to hear in the comments what you want us to do in RuneScape, because if there's, like, an overwhelming consensus of, uh... Like, what, you're, what quest you want us to play, what items you think we should go after... We still got to get a girlfriend. That's a very, I mean, we're going to well, be working on that the whole time. that's priority. That's like the base priority. That's the reason we made this account in the first place was because you and I both needed to have a singular girlfriend to share. I've been, I've been wanting that for a while. You know, we had a joint Tinder account. Um, didn't go very well. So we figured what's the next best thing? Yeah, we had to put our name as Matt Ryan. Because, like the football player. Yeah. So people got confused a lot. Jesus Christ, Connor. What the fuck? Connor. Connor! What the fuck, dude? What are you doing? 28,000 gold? <laughs> Mithril plate body? Gold trimmed rune plate body? Oh God. Five <laughs> adamant scimitars? <laughs> what? Part of me feels like some people gave him this shit, though. They, they must have. Like, this fans must've... gave him some stuff, maybe? Well, a big thank you to everyone who donated this. I'm yeah. not giving Connor credit for getting this stuff. This was all This was all you guys. Look at <laughs> not rubies giving and Connor emeralds. any credit. Brass necklace? Hell yeah, dude. Wow. We got a bow. Dude, do you know how much gold gold trimmed rune is? No. Rune rune is if you're not a member, rune is the best armor you can get. And this is gold trimmed. Uh and then adamant's really good too. Adamant's like a step above mithril. And we have five adamant skimit is it scimitar or skimitar? I don't know. Sk See, I was I was kind of a when I played this, I didn't pay attention to what armor was better. I just wanted to look cool. So I was like, Yeah, oh, that armor looks cool. I want it. I personally I, I like mithril. I like the color, but I, I really like rune too. I like the black and gold uh, armor people had on. I don't know what that was. What that was called though. Oh, it was just black uh, armor with gold trim. Okay, yeah, it looked beautiful whenever I saw it. I was like, damn, dude, I know my RuneScape shit. God, he has a rune plate body as well as gold rune plate body. Two mithril plate bodies as well as the one we're wearing now. Oh my god, dude, this is insane. Got our fishing net. Got a frog mask. Ooh, can we put it on? Dude, it's. <laughs> It's like Pepe. <laughs> ooh, ooh! Fishing net. Is that pick a box X. of cookies? Where? Box of cookies? That white box of cookies in our inventory. Ryan, that's the tinder box for starting fires. What? 
Looks like a nice box of warm cookies. You open it up, steam comes out. Doesn't that sound good? <laughs> it's my cookie box. It's one of the most <laughs> crucial items in RuneScape. Okay, let's see what axes I can use with my level. Um, Adamant is 31. I can use a Mithril axe, but uh, I don't have a Mithril axe, so thanks a lot, Connor. Uh, so I'll just have to use uh, bronze. You know, real, real fucking good. Real fucking good, good axe. Connor, why didn't you just get us a bunch of goofy hats? Well, he got us a, he got us a frog mask. But Dude, you didn't put it on. I'm gonna put it on. Ready? <gasps> where, where, where? Yes! <laughs> yes! Dude, it's like the funny Pepe the Frog meme. Does the dude get to sue us now? The guy that created Pepe? Yeah. I feel bad for that guy, dude. He created this this thing that was like a funny internet meme to himself and his friends, and then it just got completely just... Just completely fucked And then the it was ass. registered as a hate symbol. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Imagine creating like a meme that's just based off your webcomic where it's a frog pissing with his pants. <laughs> so the, the origin was like, I think he's pissing with his pants all the way down. And he says, feels into his good, own man. Mouth? No, not into his own oh, mouth. Oh, okay. <laughs> The, I, I remember that when the meme started, it was like that face, and he said, he said, feels good, man. I, I remember that way back in the early meme days, and now it's a registered hate symbol. It's God, how times a hate changed. Symbol. It's a hate symbol in the hate symbol database. Which is really stupid, I have to say. That Pepe the Frog is a hate symbol? Yeah. Because it, it started getting used by a group of people, and I, I guess if that. it starts using it, if but, it's being used by, a, I guess, like a hate group, they have to register it, but... <laughs> But at the same time, then they can go and that would mean that they could use the Disney logo. And then it's like, it's a hate symbol now. Hate groups use, I guess Disney would be like. What hate groups use the Disney logo? Uh, ISIS. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I need to do one of those like me 23. 20, 23 and me? Yeah, 23 and me thing. I found out that I'm like 0.1% Azernathy Jew. Do you know that? Is that a surprise to you? Yeah, why would it not be? Is this about my nose, Ryan? It's not. Why would you immediately go? Why are you? Because you you're said trying to put me in a corner. You said it's a surprise to, make, to you. I'm not making fun. Of, I'm just saying, like, you're you're a very uh, white, well well off. Uh, I, a bi your business is doing well, so uh, you might you might have a bit of the Jew in you. What are you What are you saying right now? Are you Are you going with with an old stereotype right now? No, it's not an that old Jews stereotype. It's not a It's not a negative stereotype to say Jewish people are successful. That really is not a neg like you know like a lot of races do have some pretty negative stereotypes. But being <laughs> successful with business is definitely like I'd be like okay, I'll embrace that. Being good with like being fight like fiscally responsible. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, it's like it's like hey, sure. wait a second, <laughs> I a, am. <laughs> that's a pretty good stereotype. I do have to say. So we have to go to. Uh, that's Ice Mountain. We have to go to a... Isis Mountain? No, Ice Mountain. Oh, we have it to had go... a Disney logo on it, so it confused me. <laughs> we have to go to White Wolf Mountain, which okay. is in this members-only uh, area. So, we're... guys, in this episode, we're going to cross over into members-only territory. And I'm all... Don't worry, I'm all out of stamina, so I can't run there. So we can walk slowly and wait. Uh... I wish it would just go one up a second. But it... it, it no, they chose to, you yeah. know. Still at five. Shall we... Uh, shall... Oh, let's do the Shrek on my way. Misery and happiness to be. Can't, can't, that's copyright uh -huh, material. Can't uh -huh. use we, can, that. we can cover it though, right? Wait, I'm on like, my way. I'm on my way. No, 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 no. You forgot the most crucial part. No, like, no, no, uh -huh, no, no, uh -huh. no. That's my favorite part though. What part? When it's like. I'm on my way. And then it starts again right after that. Yeah. I used to. Uh, I had a friend in middle school. And on the bus, he'd bring like a little, um, he'd bring like a little portable CD player, uh, you know, like the like the old school ones. And he yeah. he just had the Shrek soundtrack on CD, and he'd just sit on the bus with his headphones and listen to the Shrek soundtrack unironically. There you go. Yeah. Woo. It's a journey. This sounds now. like this actually sounds like this. Wait. Oh, I'm gonna do it. Now I'm the type of guy that'll never settle down. It sounds like the same opening to me. As what song? I'm uh, on culture with this old music. Wanderer? Yes, yes. I'm a wanderer. Isn't that from and the I'm Fallout? Around, around, around. What? Is that from a Fallout trailer? I don't know. I Is think it? I think that song was used in, in in a Fallout trailer. Might have been like Fallout 4. I think it was used in Fallout 4, yeah. I, I, I don't yes, know. Yes, it was. I know okay. for a fact it was. I'm the type of guy. And it, it, if I'm incorrect, then I just looked like a fool because I said I know for a fact. <laughs> I know for a fact. I, f I feel like... Can you look that up, Ryan? If that song was used in any kind of promotional material for Fallout? Uh, Wanderer. Look up Wanderer Fallout. Fallout. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm looking it. I'm looking it. Yes! Oh, that's so good. that's not the actual. Oh. Um, someone just made a fan thing of it. Um, I, I just remember that being like a commercial. Oh, wait, PlayStation Europe? 
Is, it, is that it? Yeah. Yes. Maybe. Yeah, because it had all the footage of the nuke stuff. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. We'll see if this video makes any money. <laughs> they're gonna pick up the- Those copyright systems are very, like- They're good. They're, they're really good now. fucking good. You used to be able to change speed and, like, just little things, but You can't now... even change pitch now. Like, they figure it out. I know. How it's do they crazy. do it? Like, like, I'll, I'll take a song, like, an instrumental version of a song, and, like, change the speed by, like, 125%, and they flag it instantly. I'm well, like, how? When technology can do, like, multiple calculations within milliseconds, I mean, I guess, like, it doesn't- it's not, like, it's hard for us because it's like, as a human, it's like, how do you figure that out? But I'm sure technology is like, fuck you. Dude, it is so smart. Technology has just, it surpassed us. Speaking we're, of surpassing- We're moving too fast, dude. We are, dude. We're moving way too fast. I'm we getting scared. To, we need to calm down. We need to be like, okay, let's hold up. Let's just, let's, let's let, um, our general population get accustomed to technology. Because most people, like, at least that I they see- fucking grew up in the 20s, dude. <laughs> Baby boomers! My grandpa was born in like 1920 something. He does not know what a computer is. And and here I am, his grandson, a famous Let's player. All all in two generations. See, you could you could introduce him to the internet age by letting him watch That's uh, not super gonna mega happen videos. whatsoever. Cause like cause he doesn't even know what a computer is, and then I show him my voice coming out of the screen, making jokes about like having sex with my sister, and he's gonna be like, huh. Okay. Damn. That's- that's some good shit. <laughs> He's smoking some, like, a big old blunt. <laughs> Damn, man. My grandpa- <laughs> <laughs> That shit's dank. Whoa, Matt. What the fuck? Matt fucks his sister? Is that Roblox, man? That looks like a Roblox character. Okay, so I just entered the first members only area, so- Who is this? Welcome, is guys. We're here in a new members only part of the map. Uh, I talked to a boy and, and he sobbed. It's it's a Roblox boy. <laughs> Roblox. <laughs> oh man! But doesn't this look like a Roblox character dressing up as Ned Flanders? <laughs> yeah, he's got the Ned Flanders look. The boy sniffs like. All right, that was pointless. All right, I need to go to White Wolf Mountain. So, uh... okay, I could start by speaking to the dwarves at the tunnel entrances on either side of White Wolf Mountain, and uh, I am at White Wolf Mountain. Where are the tunnel? I think these are the tunnel entrances right here. Are these tunnel entrances? Are they? Are they tunnel entrances? Well, let's go, uh... Let's well, I guess check we'll, it out. I guess we'll, uh, find out in the next episode. I guess you could say that, Ryan. <laughs> we will. I'm so- we're sorry that this was a travel- uh, Well, bye!